have worked hard to reach more customers through Facebook, but one wrong click has turned into a nightmare for a Casey County company. Tartar Farm and Ranch Equipment fell victim to a phishing scam. A hacker took over the company's Facebook page and posted racy material. So what can you do to make sure this doesn't happen to you? Garrett Weimer has the story new at 11. It started with a simple Facebook message. It looked to be a notification from Facebook. It looked very legitimate. When he clicked on it, he filled in his credentials. But it wasn't from Facebook, and whoever got access shut everyone else out of the page. Now, when people go to Facebook and look us up, they're going to see that horrible, horrible posting. The page's 126,000 fans now see links decidedly not safe for work, let alone TV, and certainly not family friendly. It's 180 degrees diametrically opposed to the lifestyle that we live, we promote, and we sell. The Better Business Bureau says, unfortunately, these so-called phishing scams are all too common, and it's something businesses especially need to watch out for. Facebook also says they will never ask you for a password, login information in an email like that. That would have been the warning sign here. Someone probably thought that they were doing the right thing, and it ended up going completely wrong. As the company works to take back control of their page and stop the hackers' hijinks, Tartar says they want others to watch out. If you're unsure, just back away. Don't click on anything. And uh, if you want to see Tartar products, go to TartarUSA.com. Don't go to our Facebook. Let's give us a few weeks. <laughs> In Lexington, Garrett Weimer, WKYT. Well, what a frustrating thing to have happened. Harder says they've reached out to Facebook about the hacking, but so far they have not received much response and are having trouble getting the situation fixed.